At a national prayer breakfast yesterday, Trump took a page out of the Roy Cohn playbook when he accused the House of Representatives impeachment managers of this. Country and your president have been put through a terrible ordeal by some very dishonest and corrupt people. By some very dishonest and corrupt people, I think he's referring to the House Representatives impeachment managers there and accusing them essentially of the very same things he was in fact accused of would have made his old friend and lawyer Roy Cohn very happy. Another term for what Trump does is called psychological projection. Nancy Pelosi was at the same prayer breakfast just four chairs away and Trump snuck this jab in for her and also a jab to Mitt Romney as well. Right. I don't like people who use their faith as justification for doing what they know is wrong. Nor do I like people who say, I pray for you, when they know that that's not so. It's a baseless argument for Trump to attack anyone based on their religious beliefs, and he did that right in the middle of a prayer breakfast without as much as a peep from any religious person present at that breakfast. It's a baseless argument for Trump to attack someone based on their religious beliefs as if his interpretation of religion is conclusive and paramount. This is the kind of stuff you would hear from dictators and autocrats, and not usually from the President of the United States, folks, where we value religion and respect someone's right to express and follow their religious beliefs without persecution. Yesterday, Donald Trump trampled that right at the National Prayer Breakfast.